He believed in the heart of the cards. He drew it and he milled just enough. Just ooh. Now the uh, question is, will you get lucky enough to win game three as well? Yep, lucky enough. Because <laughs> <laughs> yeah. he totally won that second game because of luck. Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I would never play this deck ever. <laughs> uh, that deck's like the complete opposite of my play style. Exactly. I'm I'm a control duelist. I ain't no luck for those. I'm not lucky. I'm not aggressive. So. I don't like neither one of the two things about Infernoids. Plus, you gotta play Skillless Trash with them. That automatically <laughs> make me not like them. <laughs> What's next? You gonna throw JD in there? Like, oh hell no! I gotta worry about JD wiping me and that fucking or no chudu chudu do la. The fucking Chudo guy fucking wiping my ass too. Like, no, thank you. <laughs> That's a definition of annoying. <laughs> <laughs> I'm this guy right here, freaking red nosed pigfish. I can actually imagine that, like. <laughs> Can you imagine them making a Yu-Gi-Oh card like that. They have, <laughs> they have seven colored fish, so why not have red nosed pig fish? Bam! Scout. All and three games. Congratulations. The duel begins. Pay that eight hundred. <laughs> or don't. Or not. I know. Or not. Just sit here. <laughs> He's just, he's just sitting here contemplating. He's just afraid of a new shoot. A note. I forgot what his name was already. <laughs> I forgot he's it. afraid of that random main deck to hold a purple light or something. <laughs> I forgot that boss monster's name without looking at it. I forgot his name already. On, oh my god, on seriously, YouTube? guys. Seriously, come on. Come on, please. I'm about, to, <laughs> oh I'm, I'm about to pause this video until you guys do something. I know, that's what I have to do sometimes, because these stupid guys just don't know how to play. Or... <laughs> Sorry, I accidentally fainted. <laughs> I accidentally fainted from your power. From the epicness of my hand. It was just too good. I couldn't... Damn, my, my, key, my, my keyboard ran out of batteries. Mm. What? I didn't even know they had keyboards that ran on batteries. Me either. Got Wireless it. keyboard? That sounds kind of dumb, but alright. <laughs> like, either you're using the keyboard because you had a desktop, or you're using a laptop, so it's already tense in the screen, you know what? I'm not even gonna question it. <laughs> no reason to apologize. Hell, fuck you, there's no reason to apologize. You're <laughs> sitting here waiting for, like, at least five minutes. Hurry that shit up. Okay, so back to the duel, finally. Seriously. <laughs> Let's see if the announcer's luck. All right. He first still turn plays... shell again. He played shell. He did shell? that game one. Yeah, he did that game one. Who first the turn fuck shell. Plays shell. No one plays shell anymore. Apparently, this guy does. You don't play shell anymore. <laughs> yeah, stealth is overall just a lot better. Mm -hmm. OCG, I think they only play like one one disc. <laughs> They're like, if I ain't going for the TK, I don't need it. But they always need that stealth. Shit, they don't even run um, trample links anymore because of stealth. OCG is a whole nother beast, though. All right, Mr. Announcer, you top decked the shit out of that last duel, so I want to see you fucking use your skills again. Wow. Risky play. That is a risky play. Guess he didn't open up that amazing. I don't know. Alright, so I guess he's gonna go ahead and attack. And then at the end of the battle phase, he can banish one card on the field, so. <sighs> now the problem is, he could just simply search a scout with the sacrifice that. Yeah. You know. Unless he banishes the sacrifice. That might be best. No, no, no. But then he's gonna get the sacrifice. And you left scout. Again! Like. It would have been best to banish the scout. Wait, how would he banish, banish the scout? Is it it's a monster on the field? I thought it was a card. Is this card in the opponent's graveyard. No, no. Or banish one card on the field. Yeah, oh. banish one card on the field. Too much reading. So he can banish one on the field and then also do it from the graveyard too. So, so that was the wrong choice. Yeah. If he banished the scout, yes. If he banished the sacrifice, yes. You, you already clicked. You know what? 
I love how you can always take shit back here on fucking the end. Like, I guess you don't want to uh. get punished for fucking up unless you're in wide jump, but whatever. It still should have been the scout. You could have handled the sacrifice next turn. Unless you got a twister in there, which you probably do, because... Keep it in MST against... That was end phase. Okay. Alright. Guess he's keeping an MST, just a end phase MST, whatever he wants to end phase set. So, I guess he did have the right choice, but... Too bad he had the MST, unless that other that card is a twister, too. I must say, that was a really risky play, but it wasn't terrible. Just really risky. You negged two. You know, yeah, if he would have had anything to stop that summon, it wouldn't have looked good at all. Mm -mm. It's a good thing that they're inherent. Yeah. See, that preemptive vanities. Not bad. So that was a lucky blind space by Red Nose. That yeah. Other... yeah, definitely. That twister would have definitely hit that, uh, that scout. Yep. Overall, I gotta give it to him. That wasn't a terrible play. Banishing and sacrifice, and then hopefully twistering the, the, the scout. Overall, not terrible. So, are you gonna attribute the? You gonna attribute the shell? He's waiting for a response. <laughs> what? Would you correct him? See your sacrifice? Yeah, sure. No. <laughs> Might be another skill prisoner, I guess. I don't know. We saw a whole bunch of those in the second game, but I don't really know what else he could activate in response to sacrifice. It's not a lot that you'd want to activate anyway. I mean, unless you really want to MST just to give him the search, but. Huh? Wait a minute. You had an MST and you didn't MST <laughs> that scout? What? You had an MST and. I don't even know what's going on anymore. I don't know what's going on anymore either. <sighs> I mean, that play wasn't terrible, it's just. You could have stopped it a long time ago. Now you can get your, uh. Your. Oh my god. Setisma. Setisma. Fuck you, Konami. Come on. Why? <laughs> I hate you so much. <laughs> Konami just like, hmm. Oh, we gotta think of a name for these Inferno monsters. Uh, I know. Inferno. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I mean, there are like, <laughs> what, two, three thousand cards in the game, so they're gonna run out of names eventually, but man, like, seriously? Shit, fuck that. I'll get you no. the numbers. I'll be like, this is Infernoid 1, this is Infernoid 2. <laughs> like, I ain't fucking around. <laughs> so that play wasn't terrible, because now that monster can attack him, run over the shell unless he has another sacrifice, and then banish the scout next turn, so. But you should have just MST'd the scout before he even did that, but. I'm not going to tell you how to play Infernoids. You're still down on resources, so. I really hope he has nothing to stop you. I hope that he doesn't have a Forbidden Chalice, because he's going to get wrecked. Hmm. Yeah, he could grab another Sacrifice right now if he wanted to, because he could play that other Scout that he added, and then Tribute for, like, a Disc or something, but I guess he doesn't have it. Yeah, I mean, I used to think that having double Scout in your Pendulum Zone was bad, but, you know, the double searching is good, and, uh... And you can always just put one back in your hand with um with stealth, so Yeah. So you pretty much say I'm not gonna pen to something, but I'm gonna get double the searches, so it's a very powerful play. Oh. Okay. And trip his monster and draw two. And now uh doesn't this have to this card attack some opponent's monster, so yeah, no, there's no more monsters, so I guess you're just gonna take the twenty six on the chin. That was a pretty good play, I guess. Yeah, yeah, I'll give it to you. I'll give it to you. That was a pretty good play. So, attack you for 26. Oh, there's that powerful reasoning again. Reasoning went up to three, right? Yeah. Okay, I keep forgetting. Mm-hmm. 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 
<laughs> all three games, it's been the friggin' the mm -hmm. Raiden. That's always the Wow. <laughs> I, I mean, is it, you know, the only other one that he can hit is what, Lumina? I'm not sure if this guy runs Card Trooper. And I know he runs Lila, but that would get her here too. So, but it's always Raiden. <laughs> Raiden yeah. getting Rex. The unlucky Light Sword, I guess. <laughs> All right, this clay player is definitely not out. You have five life... cards in your hand. You probably have what at least one emptiness in there, so it should be game. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and give him a thousand life points. I'm a, I'm a pretty big proponent of Clee's running up start. They should, should also too. They need to get to their their key cards as quick as possible. Oh, he's thinking. That's a long video. <laughs> yeah, the Skype's already been going, what, for 40 minutes now? Hmm. I could probably cut this up. Yeah, but we also paused. Let me think. We paused for five minutes. Yeah. Waited for him we're, to uh, fix at, his keyboard. <laughs> uh, we're at 33 minutes. Oh, I, I forgot. You, the way you record it doesn't tell you how long the video is. What do you use? Oh, I use, or it tells me it's. Oh, let me <laughs> check it real quick. BB no. Flash Black Express Recorder. I don't know what that is. <laughs> That's what Capital G uses too. I've seen him oh, in his okay. oh. recent videos. <laughs> I use Hacktasia. <laughs> Hacktasia? Yeah, I just rip off Camtasia. <laughs> <laughs> you know how to rip off Camtasia? Pretty much. Yeah, you, you pretty much you get the 30 day trial, and when you're 30, and then you just get a code, like code that doesn't even work, because they'll tell you that it doesn't work and it's not even used much. But all you have to do is when you go into Camtasia, you just pl unplug your internet, then put the code in, and then they'll be like, oh, it's a problem on our end. You can still continue using your free trial and just plug your internet back in and just don't close Camtasia. Nice strategy, man. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Why didn't I think of that? <laughs> so I'm just like, I would never pay you Camtasia. <laughs> uh, it's only a hassle when, you know, like, Camtasia crashes or like, mom turns off the computer. But I have to tell her. There's two things you never turn off. Never turn off my computer and never turn off my cell phone. <laughs> they take forever to turn back on. <laughs> oh, shit. We're talking about checking recording devices here. Hello? Supposed to be watching so off school. topic, I know. Yeah. This guy's Nothing's taking forever, though. He is. Like, hurry this shit up. <laughs> I want to see this duel ended. The duel should have ended yesterday. How is it possible? I mean, I guess if you're in... England, I think? They're like, what, six hours ahead of us? Yeah, they're a couple hours ahead of us. I don't even know what they're They're eight hours ahead of where you are, but... Yeah. Yeah. But anyway, doing? hurry up, man. Come on. You live on the East Coast? Uh, I'm in Central Time, so not East Coast oh, Time. okay. So you're two hours ahead of me. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, he's put some stealth, okay. You <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> swear to god, you don't have to say how many pendulum, just pendulum, shit. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. <laughs> you don't have to announce that you're tributing either. Nope. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah, like that starts a chain or something. You can just tribute. It took you that long to do that, like really. That took you it took really? you that long. That long. So unfortunately announcer wasn't lucky enough to to get the third game, but but that second game, yep. Yeah, that second game was. You know what? Awesome you know what? I'm gonna cut this. I'm gonna cut this into, into two parts because this was long. Okay. I don't. You know, my viewers actually been complaining about these videos being too long anyway. They don't want to sit here for like a half an oh, hour. Oh, what? Yeah. The longer the better. Yeah, some people are like, That's I my hate motto. it. They hate it. They're like, fuck that. They get intimidated by the half an hour daily duels and the half an hour vitamin Y and the you know all of that shit. So that's fine. I don't care. More views for me. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so thank you for joining me, Stu. No problem.
And uh, I will see you guys next week in some more DM Do commentary. I'm not sure who's joining me. I just decided. I really, I only had Stu to join because I wanted to get his opinion about the channel change. I'm not even sure if it was Stu's turn. <laughs> uh, uh, it was. Oh, uh, it was? I think. I don't know. I think, <laughs> actually, I think it's actually Lunar's turn, but Lunar still has his computer down, so. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for watching.